Hey folks, Worldwide DJ Freebird, welcome back to AFB Radio, and right here with me is Burns and Poe, Brian Keith Burns, somebody I've known for many years. A lot Man, of years. You great to back? see you, brother, so good, good to see you back. See you. And you called him Brian, that goes Very right nice back. to meet you too, Miss Poe. <laughs> now, you. guys, tell me what's going on with you in the music business. Now, these guys have been around the block a while, folks. Now, <clears throat> let me back it up and give you a brief story. I met Keith back in the day when it was Midnight Rider, mm-hmm. changed it to Heartbreak Highway, Toured with Joe Diffie, right. was with Trick Pony, and now it's Burns and Poe. Yes. Congratulations on your success, brother. Thank you. I appreciate that. And, you know, just lucky. A lot of hard work and a lot of luck. But, you know, uh, just excited about working with Michelle. Michelle's been, she was on DreamWorks Records uh, three or four years ago, and I'd seen her around at different award shows and stuff like that. She's played bass for Dirks Bentley. And, and uh, when Heidi left Trick Pony, we got to get, you know, we, James Stroud, who was producing our record, he brought Michelle to the table and, and said, hey, I think I think this girl would be perfect for y'all. And as soon as we hired her, Ira decided he was gonna gonna take off and do a solo thing. So I'm like, wait a minute. started calling me Dark Cloud. Dark, yeah, Dark well, Sock. Well, you know, <laughs> you're a lovely lady. Now, how is <laughs> it working you. with this guy? So far, so good. I mean, I, he's motivated, he's driven. I love his songwriting. I've learned a lot from him. Well, now, I, I can personally tell you, back in the day, this guy was motivated years ago a lot. Yeah, and he's um, type A for sure. I mean, he is just <laughs> unbelievable. And I've been trying to get a hold of him for so many years because, you know, I knew I knew him from way back as a young adult, rather, when they, uh, we were in the <laughs> yeah, bars. Yeah, play. Yeah, I don't want to say a hard. teenager. Well, yeah, I was well, one of the passy ones, too, you know, but well, whatever. <laughs> But we had a lot of good time, a lot of great shows back in the day. Yeah, and so um, so what's on the roster now for you guys? What's going on? Well, we just finished this, uh, the CD. We're in the process of actually, you know, wrapping it up. We got the single out right now, Don't Get No Better Than That. Uh, it's top 20 on uh, on Music Road chart right awesome. now. Go, uh, going for ads as we speak on the P1 stations. Nice. And in the midst of a nationwide radio tour to go visit radio and introduce them to the new user we've already been to about 70 radio stations we're gonna probably hit about 30 more before we're done and and we're booking dates booking shows doing our thing just trying to trying to make the the world uh, aware of burns and poe awesome well now miss poe i gotta ask you uh how long are you here in Asheville? is that where you live yes, where you're from 91 yes since 91 mm-hmm. now have you been – now, he said you played bass with Keith Burns, is that correct? I mean, uh, sorry, Keith Urban? Um, no. Uh, well, we were on tour with him for a while, but I played with a guy named Steve Holy and then Dirk Bentley, okay. and for the past five years I've been with Hank Jr. Really? Yeah. See, this gets better every time, folks. You never know who you're going to meet up here. But, well, look, I know you guys are busy on schedule. I have another interview that's here finally. But, you know, Keith, it's so great to see you. And I wish you the best in the business. It's I mean, a pleasure, man. I've, we got to exchange numbers. Yeah, we I'm going to give it to you before you leave here. We can't go 20 years that's again right. before we talk. Absolutely. And, Miss Poe, nice God bless you. And I hope everything works for you with Thank Burns you so and Poe.